What's going on, good people? It's Baba Will. Please like, share, and subscribe to the video. Don't forget to hit the notification tab or bell so that way anytime my videos are uploaded, I have new material that's out there. You'll be the first to know and you can watch my videos. So let's get right into it. Uh, you know, men who cheat, right? There are different reasons why men cheat, but I, you know, I'm going to speak about the specific thing that men, some men do when they cheat. They, you know, like the old saying goes, they want their cake and eat it too. They have someone that they're in a relationship with, they're faithful, they have a wife, you know, a girlfriend, committed relationship, very serious. But outside of that relationship, they carry on and, you know, meet other people, even have other affairs outside of their main relationship or outside of their marriage and so forth and so on. But then when something happens, you know, what, what, what I find funny is that it, it's weird because men, like, okay, some feel entitled. Some have that sense of entitlement where they feel like they can just play the field, be in a relationship, committed relationship, and play the field, but the woman can't. Right? If the woman does, oh, they become heartbroken. They're just complete, they're just shredded. They, you know, ripped to shreds. You know, you just fall apart. I'm like, what happened? The rules don't go for them either? I guess not. I guess the rules don't go for them. I guess the women can't do with the men. So it's weird because, you know, you'll have a, a, a home, right? Let's say you live, you know, you have some of these men, they live home with their wives, you know, or if they, in case they're not married, you know, committed faithful relationships, supposed to be faithful. Um, but outside of that, you know, they'll flirt with people at their jobs, flirt with other women at their jobs, flirt with other women just in the public, outside, period, right? And it's okay, but then they profess the love that they have for their wife. So, when the tables are turned and the wife now decides to step out of the relationship and also do her own thing, meet other men or meet other people, you know, these men who initially were cheating become distraught. They fall apart. Why? Why are you falling apart? I don't, I don't, why? Why are you falling apart? You know, it's only, you know, you the only ones that can do what you do. The double standard is real, right? The double standard is real. I mean, I've, I've you know, I mean, people fall apart. Like these guys, they just, you know, the machismo, you know, uh, tough man, masculine, everything, you know, big, you know, you know. Ladies, men, you know, will fall apart when they find out that their wives are seeing other people. Like they just their 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 whole that whole tough exterior, that macho stuff goes flying out the window. Why? Why does it fly out the window? I I, I just don't know. I don't understand. I don't I don't understand. You should be able to kind of like, you know, be able to take a taste of your own medicine. I mean. But some people can't handle it. They'll just say it. They'll talk. They'll talk a good talk. But when it's about action, when 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 certain things rise to the surface, they can't handle it. They fold. They buckle. Like they just. It just. It's the truth. Men get emotional too. Some of them, you know, they just lose their minds, you know, and it could get really, really, really hairy out here. You know, <laughs> get really hairy. I I, I just. It's just something to think about, you know, sometimes, you know, men, you know, and when I'll have conversations with some of these guys, you know, because I, you know, all through the years I've, I've, I've met 
many, many, many people. And just, I, I just, I'm fascinated sometimes. You know, I think, you know, why, what's the point in pairing up with so many people? If you're looking for, if you're looking for one monogamous relationship, and especially if you're looking for a monogamous union, and you have it. Now, no, no relationship is perfect. No, no situation is perfect. But you found that one monogamous union, right? And on top of that, for whatever reason, you go outside of that and you're making connections with other people. That I mean, what you you can't you you just can't expect everything to go your way all the time because when she decides to do something different by way of not being faithful to you and stepping outside of her relationship your relationship with her and meet other guys and do the same thing that you're doing even sleeping with other other people the same thing that you're doing you I, how can you be upset it's upsetting absolutely but you got to think about how she felt, how she's been feeling, you know, the whole time you've been cheating on her or you've been unfaithful because women have intuition. Women have intuition, that gut, inst that gut feeling that they have, you know, that's what keeps them, you know, their, their, their levels on point. And when their levels are, you know, when, when the signals are on and it's it's just red flags are taking place, they, they generally have a great reason why they're feeling the way they're feeling is because something is not right. You know, so, you know, men are very visual, you know, we're very visual. We like what we see and we, we go for what we see, what's appealing. But when you're digging, when you're talking about something a little bit more in depth as far as relationships you can't i mean if you're going to take care of the relationship take care of the relationship and and everything that comes with it because when you're stepping outside and you're cheating and you're being unfaithful and you mean and then that causes other problems because if you're cheating if you're sleeping with other people and you know you're practicing unsafe sex etc etc you have children outside of these relationships outside of these monogamous I mean, it gets really, really hairy. It gets, it gets even more complicated. You're creating families outside of your 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 home, and then when your when your wife does something similar to that, it's 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 it, it's ugly. It gets ugly. It gets ugly. So I just find it interesting. Like, share, subscribe. You know, to the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. But, you know, this is not something that is going to change. I, you know, I've seen it. I've, I, I, I know people who live this way. And there's no judgment. It's just the thing of, okay, well, face, face the music in a sense. Like, this is what we're dealing with. This is what it is. How are we going to move past this? How are we going to, you know, people don't like to do certain things. They, like, they just, again... They want to have their cake and eat it too. They want to have their cake and eat it too. And women are not innocent. Not by a long shot. Let me be clear on that. I know I so I made some videos and I'm, you know, speaking from a male perspective as far as, you know, certain deficiencies and flaws that men have. But women are not innocent either. Women are also emotionally immature. Let's be clear. <laughs> We have some people out here, some women out here who are very selfish too and they have their own issues. But for the sake of this video, I'm talking about from a male perspective, you know, the cheating factor. Why, what, if, you know, it, you, you have a, you have, you in a relationship and you want to cheat, but then you fall apart when you find out that your wife no longer wants you. Right. Because she might have found someone else or just doesn't want to be with you anymore. And you just. Now you become like this sensitive, this big, sensitive ball of nerves. Like I can't. I don't understand. I don't, I don't know. Uh, it happens.
It happens. People lose their mind, so their rationality goes out the out of the window. Just gone. <laughs> That's it. That's it. You know, it's crazy. It's crazy. You know, but listen, listen, listen. No judgment. Like, share, and subscribe to my video, and leave a comment. Good comments. Um, constructive comments. Keep keep a discussion. Let's create a discussion. All right. I'm gonna see y'all later. Be well. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>